Today I'm going to show you how to make almond praline. Um, you can make a nut praline with any nut of your choice, but today I chose almonds. So you're always going to want to start off by making sure that your nuts are thoroughly toasted. This is going to make sure they kind of stay crunchy and you get the best flavor out of them. And then for our sugar, it's just gonna be a one-to-one -one ratio of water and sugar. So I'm just doing a cup of water to a cup of sugar, and then just a little corn syrup to help it from crystallizing. And then we're just gonna caramelize this and pour it over the nuts when it's ready. You're gonna wanna make sure that your nuts are spread out across your sheet tray and it's lined, so it'll make it a lot easier to get the praline off of the pan. You can also use a silt mat, whatever you prefer. Now that our sugar is fully caramelized, we're just gonna pour it straight onto this pan. And I like spreading it around so it all doesn't clump together in the middle. And now from here, I just gently move it around a little bit. You don't wanna move it too much because it can seize the sugar. So it's okay if all the nuts aren't covered. Sometimes I'll just kind of throw them back into the mix. And then we're gonna let this cool off completely and then I'll show you how we can chop it up. When the praline has fully cooled down, you can just take it and peel it off of the parchment and just crack it with your hand and it should snap right in half. And then from there, you can just break it up into little tiny pieces or use it however you want. Um, I did cut some down, so we have some bigger chunks here. And then a really nice fine powder here. So yeah, and then you can use it to garnish it, whatever you want. That's how you make praline.